Good day everyone, everybody, YouTubers out there, Comrade64, back again with a new video. And, well, the day is here. It is finally 2014. Let's give a round of applause. We finally made it. 2014. Yep. Yeah, uh, this year is definitely going to be one of the best years ever. I got to tell you that. Um, we got movies, games, uh, what else? Um, yeah, a bunch of other stuff coming our way. Great. Um, like, um, and I expect that this year probably will be way better than 2013. I mean, 2013, it was, yeah, you know, all right. You know, it was great and all, but I just kind of felt like, you know, not much was basically, you know, added, you know, like, well, some, in terms of movies, sure, yeah, and games, sure, but I just didn't feel like, you know, there were, I didn't really think there was really much that kind of interests me, because, like, frankly, like, I didn't go to the movies that much this year, like, the last movie I saw in theaters was Thor The Dark World. And that's pretty much it. I mean, I was planning to see others like American Hustle and Anchorman 2. I think those those two are still in theaters, probably. I'm not sure. And I was thinking about seeing Frozen because I want to see that one because the people who made Wreck-It Ralph made that movie. So, and since I was a, I really I was a huge fan of Wreck-It Ralph, I figured, and hey, why not? But, you know, I just went, you know, back and forth saying, uh, I'm not sure if I really want to see this movie, you know, stuff like that. So, on the movie side, not much. I mean, yeah, sure, there was Iron Man 3, Man of Steel, The Wolverine, Thor The Dark World, Kick-Ass 2. Yeah, and if, this is the end, and, you know, a few others, but I just didn't really go to the movies really this much as much as I did like back in 2012 I did a lot I did went to movies away a lot more than I did in 2013 because in 2012 they actually had great movies that got me interested hype and wanted to see but 2013 there was only a few of them and also on the game section you know games terms of games um there were some games I've been wanting to get but um you know, I've been wanting to get Injustice, Gods Among Us, and Deadpool. I ended up getting Deadpool, but Injustice, yeah, I bought it, but I traded in because once I heard about, you know, this um, Ultimate Edition, I figured I want to get that instead. Uh, they announced the Ultimate Edition, like, I think, like, um, around, I forgot what month, later in summer 2013, the later 2013, I f forgot. So, yeah. And like um, so not much really a variety that kind of gave me a good hype. But I'm sure that 2014 will basically give me a great hype. Um, and also oh I forgot to say a happy New Year too as well. Okay now, here's what I I'm gonna tell you what I'm excited for in 2014, this month this year. Um. For movies, I'm excited for Captain America, The Winter Soldier, X-Men Days of Future Past, The Amazing Spider-Man 2, and Guardians of the Galaxy, which is, which is what I'm really, really, really looking forward to. And um, a few others, um, yeah, uh, Robocop, Dawn of the Planet of the Apes, yeah. And um, in terms of games, there's... Super Smash Bros. for Wii U and 3DS, Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze, Kirby Triple Deluxe, Yoshi's New Island, and um, so far that's pretty much it. And like, oh yeah, and Mario Kart 8, I probably might get that, I probably might not, um, but you know, I have Mario Kart 7, so why not? So, um, yeah, that's pretty much my hype for 2014. Um, Commodore 64, signing out, and Happy New Year's.